This is a 1941 Chrysler Royal four-door sedan. Beautiful car and the uh, fog lamps are uh, smoked lenses, interesting, as well as the uh, headlamps. I really don't know the purpose of that. Perhaps it was a wartime thing. Notice the bumper guards, uh, actually three, one in the front and two on the sides. Beautiful two-tone combination and notice how the hood goes up on both sides. Kind of like a, a winged uh, approach when both sides are up there. There you see the Spitfire six-cylinder engine. An eight-cylinder engine was uh, also available. The Royal would have been the um, economy sedan, although you'd never know it from looking at this car. Beautiful. I think one of the colors is described as being caramel and probably the other are very light, uh, very light tan. Notice the exquisite uh, hubcap and wheel trim rings. And we have a um, mud guard there in the back, uh, uh, rubber really, and uh, very large fender skirts. Notice the trunk lid is open. It has a center <coughs> stoplight, which was the <coughs> which was the way they did it for uh, about a decade in uh, Chrysler. And a rich use of plastic here. And notice that the window, when it goes down, the partition between the vent wing and the front window goes down. We also have a, uh, a visor there shielding the windshield. Notice how that uh, window and partition goes down there. And when we go around the back we see a uh, backup lamp. And uh, Venetian blinds in the back, which uh, I remember seeing fairly often back in, in that time. The spare tire is, uh, looks like it's never been on the ground. The wheel itself is painted red for contrast. Very nice. Just a, a really a beautiful car. And uh, there we have the um, guard there. It's uh, to prevent you from getting too close to the uh, curb. They called them curb feelers. A little bath air cleaner. Engine accessibility was very good here with this hinged uh, hood hinged in the middle. And the paint on the car is exceptional. Very nice.